Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. If it's your first time here, hi, I'm Sophia. Today's video is just a simple try on. We're not gonna do too much. We're not gonna beat face. We're just gonna test on some Fenty lip products. I got the Fenty Holiday Collection. I got the Glossy Posse. I wanna believe that's how they call it, say it. And this just comes with four mini gloss bombs and the names are Baby Brute, Taffy Teas, Cake Shake, and Ruby Milk. I also decided to pick up the mini stunner paint. I love the stunner paints. I have Uncensored and I have Underdog. So I'm trying to collect these like little by little because they're just really good quality. They aren't drying on the leaves. They just feel great. The color, the applicator, everything is bomb. So I already know that this is gonna be good. I just wanted some new colors. I think I saw Rihanna wearing one of the colors. I think it was the pink one. I think it was underrated. I'm not 100% sure, but we're just gonna try them out. I'm gonna give you guys my thoughts. So please make sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy it and if you're new or if you haven't subscribed yet Please make sure to subscribe join the fam and turn on your notifications So you're notified whenever I post a new video if that's all done Let's just get into it. Okay, I'm gonna start with the lip glosses just cuz it's easier to clean and then we're gonna move to the lip paints I've only tried the first you know the very first Release like the very first lip gloss the universal one. I don't know what the name is but it was something universal <laughs> yeah I really really love that one I think I used it for like six months straight they really last a long time so just getting the minis like and four of them I'm so excited at least I have glosses these glosses I know the one I tried was really like glossy <laughs> so hopefully these ones are like glossy glossy as well you guys understand what I'm saying I hope I'm just gonna open them Opening these things is another it's just another thing so just one moment ah here we go <sighs> sometimes I think they just want to torment us with the packaging like it's quite you need a little bit of force to get these out there we go okay guys so let's go ahead and try these on i'm gonna start with the ones that have less color so i'll start with these two and then we'll try these towards the end let's start with baby brute it's just giving me champagne vibes let's try it out on the lips first of all it just smells so good this one, ah, I wish I could pin down the smell. You guys know I'm bad at smells and colors. I want to say it's, it has a hint of everything. <laughs> a hint of everything good. I'm getting some vanilla, but that's all. I'm just going to apply it. If anything comes to mind, I will let you guys know. And when it comes to these glosses, I personally love the applicator. I think it's, it's a good size. It's shaped right as well this is the applicator i'm not really going to go into details because these glosses have been there for a while i just really want to share the colors or show the colors to you guys and kind of make a video out of it as well that is so creamy it smells so good i'm just gonna go one more level it's quite sticky i went in with quite a few layers so i'm gonna just so here we go we got baby brute So I think Brutes is pretty. I think it's very natural looking. It's more of an everyday lip gloss. I don't mind it. I thought it would have a little more shine than I can see. I can't even see the glitter. I am trying to find it. I don't see it. <laughs> I really don't see it. But either ways, I like the shine that it has. I love the creaminess of it. It feels really good. The smell is just... Mm. <laughs> I wish I could describe it, but I really suck at describing fragrances. So yeah, I'm, I'm of no use <laughs> when it comes to that. But I can tell you it feels good. It looks good. It looks very natural. And it's quite... It's quite thick. Like, not thick in a bad way. Thick in a way that it kind of... It really seals your lips with moisture if that makes any sense so i like it yeah i think it's a very good everyday lip gloss and yeah let's move on to the next one i'm gonna try on cake shake this one's pretty you gotta show me my girl if you worth it Okay, so first off, this one has way more shine than the other one, the baby brute, which I like because I like to shine. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> I don't even have the words. I just think it's super flattering. First of all, especially if you have darker lips, like it actually looks really good. Whoa. Hmm. 
one thing I love about these glosses is you can certainly use them as a topper, but I think on their own, like on their own, just with a lip liner and the gloss, you could actually just go away with that. Like it looks good. It looks really good. And a little bit goes a long way and it's just pretty. Honestly, from the two we've tried, this one has to be my favorite because the shine is quite evident. Like you can see the glitters on this one. Like it is there. It is present. <laughs> I think this one's a very good Christmassy holiday lip gloss. I am I'm here for the glitters in this one. I'm not really one for like brownish lip gloss or darker brown hue glosses. I don't know. I just don't think that they're the most flattering. I think the only one I own that's quite, you know, brownish is a Natasha Denona Lipophoria in caramel. I really love that one. I think it's quite balanced and I really love the color and that one's way more pigmented than this, but this looks good actually. This looks really good. And the shine guys, like I would wear this just on its own, no lip liner, nothing at all. I think it looks really really good <laughs> taffy teas i like i can't say i love it it's quite pretty it's very natural ish it just has the same vibes as the baby brute it doesn't have a lot of glitter going on but it has quite a good amount of shine like i'm not even gonna hate on this it gives your lips a little extra pink tint nothing too crazy we're gonna go on to the last one which is ruby milk i can't wait to try this on i was hoping this would be my favorite i really like the color i love what's going on but we'll see what it looks like on my face sometimes it looks good and then you try it and um, you know well i think it's pretty i really like the color of this one i really like it i wish it was you know a little bit even more like pigmented but it is quite pretty i feel like you can wear all of them without even lip lining your lips i feel like you could wear them just the way they are you don't necessarily have to use them as a topper wow this one's pretty guys this one is pretty ruby milk is it <laughs> It is it. <laughs> so I think my top two favorites would be the Ruby Milk and the uh, Cake Shake. This one, this one just came me out of the blue. I don't know. I want to kind of decide between both of them. I think if I was to choose between both of them, I'll actually pick the Cake Shake just because the glitter in this one is just it's there you know if you love your lip glosses i'll say this one's a great one to add to the collection the cake shake is but yeah i like it and then i'll say the next up will be the ruby milk uh when it comes to these two i think i'll take the taffy teas over the baby brute baby brute is very natural looking it's like nothing really is going on this one at least kind of gives me a little pink which i could use so yeah I that's it <laughs> that's about it for the glosses <laughs> okay we're gonna move on and try the lip stunner paints so of the two stunner lip paints i think i'm most excited to be trying on the rated so we're gonna save that for last i'm gonna try unmatched this one's kind of giving me uncensored vibes i don't know it kind of looks reddish it's kind of like between a red and a pink but let's try it out oh that is pretty uncensored is more of a pepe pepe red <laughs> that's the only way i can distinguish them uncensored is more of an orangey red i really love this this is my favorite red lipstick ever but let me just show you guys the difference in case you guys are a little bit you know confused because when i saw it i was like oh my god this looks like uncensored but it's actually a different tone the website describes this one as a deep cool red which is what it looks like this one is really more warmer more orangey okay so that's really the difference between both i also love the applicator it looks a little weird but it applies perfectly okay guys so here we go this is unmatched and gosh gosh i don't know like i mean i think this would look good on just about anybody any person so if you're looking for a good red like this could be for you especially if you don't like an orangey red like the uncensored yeah this one could be for you for those who like a more cooler red a cool tone red this is definitely for you i love the deepness the richness of the color i think it's quite pretty and it's almost like a pink but it's a red it's sis what's up like rihanna can just take all the coins it is quite pretty i love it i'll say to get the minis because these last a really really long time i've had the uncensored ever since it was released i think i probably maybe used about half of it i still have a long way to go and these expire every 12 months but 
who really cares <laughs> who really listens to that <laughs> so yeah i think the minis i agree by just because these last on like forever and you just need a little bit a little bit goes a long way like the pigment on this ish is just fire but anyways let's go ahead and try the last one we're gonna try underrated i think this one could be my favorite but we'll never know this one's quiet this one this one gave me a bang for my box so let's go ahead and test this out oh yeah this one's my baby this one's for me <laughs> here so this is what it looks like that is uncensored not <laughs> say uncensored <laughs> so that is underrated oh crap this stuff doesn't go out easily i'm really gonna have to scrub my lips this is so pretty guys like I like it already. My girl so fine. Where you been at babe? All this time I sit back, girl. I watch you want. What shall I say? <laughs> this color, this lipstick is baby girl approved. Like I like to consider myself a baby girl for life. And this shade right here this one's for me i like it i think it's a very pretty pink i think i as soon as i saw this on rihanna i was like what is this where can i get it okay <laughs> i don't think it's better than the uncensored i think uncensored still is my all-time favorite there's something transformative about that red lipstick i don't know what it is but this one has to be like my next best color i wish i could get more but it's just it's just the coins it's just a coin situation i love the colors i love the pigmentation on them i love that a little goes a long way i love that they are not drying so i think that's about it that's all the glosses lip paints that i got honestly underrated is a vibe i love it it's very flashy i think these shades will look good on anybody in my own personal opinion i think the lip products are better than the face products i don't know i've tried the primer i've tried the foundation i liked it but i wasn't wild but anytime i put on any lip product from fenty i'm always like yes yes sis you got this one down okay so i already tried underdog i just thought i'll give you guys a swatch just on this video uh, i do have a video wearing this um, i'll make sure to link it somewhere here on the screen i'll also leave it as an end screen for anyone who's interested this is what underdog looks like underdog is just vampy vibes like it's just very fall ish very dark they're all beautiful lip paints it just depends on what color you're feeling which one was your favorite let me know in the comment section below if you enjoyed this little video please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up it really helps the channel grow and again i should say thank you guys we just hit 1800 subscribers i know it's not a lot but I don't know. It just makes me happy. I'm happy. Okay. Thank you guys so much. If you haven't subscribed, you already know what to do. Join the fam. Subscribe and turn on your post notifications. Thank you guys so much. I will catch you guys in my next video.